It's your brother because I am your favorite pink father. It's favorite pink father thugging it everywhere. Don't believe me? Ask that bitch nigga about me. You dig? We had it again. Well, this nigga Kodak must be back on the drugs because like he's beefing with everybody. First, let's get to the 21 Savage. I, I, I didn't really hear what they had to say. It was like, if somebody's asked you, if I, somebody asked you a question, who's a bigger artist? It's either a yay or nay. It's like saying uh, uh, Jay-Z versus like J. Cole. Yeah, they're two big artists, but of course, you know, one is just bigger than the other. In this case, it was Future and 21 Savage. We know Future has more... I want to say more hits, more billboard hits, more worldwide singles, you know what I mean? 21 Savage, no, not knocking his catalog, dope artist, not really too much of a fan of his work, but he got hits too, not as big as Future. You know, Future is like, of course, Future been around, and he should, should have put a time length on who's been in the game longer, but of course, you know, Future, you know, it is what it is, <laughs> like Cameron said. But like, beefing with Ray J? Come on, cuz. Like, you, you, you a weirdo for that one. Shout out to Ray J. Shout out to L.A. Buck. I mean, like, man. Like, and I don't think Ray J was on some disrespectful shit just even saying that, you know, at times you got to tell your colleagues, hey, one of your peoples, they, they, they tripping, they need some help. Because... You you be tripping. You be tripping. Look at you 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 act like you want to go to war. The, the the project baby all over again. My nigga like You making deals, my nigga. Ain't no way you just getting off with all these charges, doing all this shit. Like, mm -mm. like You're already not good in LA. Off the nip shit, whether it was a confusion or not, like your affiliation with 22 G's already got you in some shit in the streets. Like, this ain't no, no, no Florida gang. This ain't no, no, no sniper gang shit, nigga. This is, this is politics of LA, nigga. Like, not saying Ray J the hardest motherfucker out there, but like, he ain't no pushover, my nigga. Like, bro, there ain't no pushover, my nigga. Like, guys be tripping. And like you were saying, like, Kodak, he be tripping. Like, that's all you can really say is, like, dude, you 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 at fault again. Like, niggas ain't fucking with you. You over here co-signing the 6 9 shit. You know, whatever deal you and Wack got. I mean, like, Wack be setting niggas up. And, and this should be another situation where, you know, uh, uh, there's an arbitrator or somebody that fucks with both parties. If y'all really give a fuck about these two motherfuckers, if they really bout that shit, about that life that they say they live, why don't y'all come together and, and, and get this shit squashed before we have another Drake or the Ruler situation, my nigga? Because, like, niggas fuck with both sides. Niggas fuck with Ruchi. Niggas fuck with RJ. You know, niggas fuck with O3. Niggas fuck with Draco. And I mean, niggas could have, somebody could have came through. Snoop could have came through. Be like, yo, sit down, squash this shit. YG sit down, squash his shit, you know what I mean? Cause like at the end of the day, it was somebody from that 400 camp. Not to say that I'm dry snitching, but niggas <laughs> niggas seen the videos like the motherfucking Troy Ave shit. Niggas know what, what went down. We know who was there, who attacked who, who was at with each other. So it's like, come on, my nigga. Like niggas doing shit in public. What do you expect? But like, nah. Why 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 the instigator? Why I love this shit? Wack a weirdo. But Wack still can't find out, can't find a nigga that, that, that knocked his ass out. Right, right, right. Adam. Adam. Adam, another nigga. Adam be, be, be instigating all, all, all this beef shit. I mean, trying to, trying to play this gang politics shit. But then be the first nigga to say, I'm going to call the cops. That nigga's weak. But yeah, man. Call that black, go get some help. Like like 21 was saying, you you free now. You should be focusing on getting your money, putting your team on, feeding your family, not fucking up your bag because if the breadwinner locked up, how the rest of the team going to eat? Look at Casanova. 
prime example. Sad to say, free the ape. I don't want to see no nigga in jail. Shit crazy, though. Kodak is like your special ed cousin. You fuck with him, but you don't fuck with him. You see him at the family events. You show him love. You try to check on a nigga every now and then, but like, you don't really fuck with a nigga. Like, like uh, you accept his stupidity because he's special. Like, we keep giving nigga passes, except that like, you keep fucking up. The drugs got you playing with the gang politics. Come on, my nigga. This ain't nothing to play with cubs. Blood. Zo. Like, shit crazy. Yeah, man. I said, I want to see these niggas go ahead and squat this shit. Come on, somebody speak up on this shit, man. He said, we know Kodak with the fuckery. I ain't, I ain't going to take what he what, what, what he what he does, know what I mean? I got niggas that fuck with them niggas. I'm from Broward County, know what I mean? Ray J, shit, you know? Psh, yo, I ain't going to speak on that's another conversation. But I ain't going to talk about fucking head off. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. Stay tuned. A lot of dope shit coming your way. Podcast with Scott LaRock Jr. Other events with Little Blood. Shit, stay tuned. A lot of dope shit coming your way. This Details in the description box below. Till next time, I'll smoke for you, boy. Triples.